What's up, amigos? Today, we're looking at the aerodynamics of the Jurassic Park Jeep from the first Jurassic Park that won in like 1993, whatever it was. And I've done two sets of streamlines. So the first set of streamlines are coming from upstream. The second set are in the cabin and they're in blue. So they're not actually um, referring to the velocity, whereas the other streamlines are. Interestingly, the streamlines in the cabin really stay very separated from the other streamlines. They just keep going around and around and don't really escape. And at the front of the Jeep, this looks like pretty much a Jeep Wrangler. So at the hood and the windshield, there's this recirculation zone. So that's pretty cool. And then the rest of the flow just jumps over. So this is pretty much just a, a moving brick through the air. And now we have the Y plane going through the Jeep. And interestingly, you can see how big the wake is. I mean, it's just huge. But then the recirculation zone at the front with the hood and the windshield, you can see that there's like this separation zone, like this line of really slow flow. And then inside that flow, there's this other like bubble kind of thing with a slightly higher velocity. That's really cool. I don't see that too often. And these animated streamlines show that inside the cabin, you have all these tiny little slow moving streamlines over the top of the vehicle. All this flow just, get, just popped up and has to go around and it loses a lot of uh, velocity. Then the flow around the tires are not too bad. It stays fairly quickly, I guess. It's fairly, fairly fast, sorry. Not too bad. So that's the end of the simulation. Make sure to like, subscribe. And if you want to get better at CFD yourself, check out our courses, which we do in the description, the links there. So check that out. And I'll see you in the next simulation. Peace out, amigos.